In this video presentation, we're going to cover thermal pads and how to solder mask define them. The first thing you have to figure out is what is your hole size for your via, because you want your via hole to be placed in between the paste mask apertures. Let me give you an, an example. Let's say that you want your vias to be 0.2 millimeter. That means that your minimum space between your apertures should be, let's go to your apertures over here. Okay, surface mount, QFN, QFN, demo, and paste mask. Right now the paste mask is set to 0.2, but if I drop a via here, in this area right here, I want to make sure that I have at least 0.1 millimeter on each side of the via. So therefore, if I have a 0.2 millimeter hole, I want a 0.4 millimeter gap in between. Therefore, I need to go into Tools, Options, and I'm going to do two things. In Pad Stack Rules, in the Thermal Pad area, I'm going to say that we're going to check off the tab, Thermal Tab Paste Mask Solder Mask Defined. And we're going to say that the minimum space between the checkerboard is going to be 0.4. And then close, save, calculate, a new pattern, paste mask. And then here is the paste mask. It's whatever size it is. And then here is the solder mask. And it's the same size as the paste mask. They're identical one to one. And then therefore you can put your 0.2 millimeter holes here, 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 in the center, and up and down here, and up and down here and here. And you won't get any solder in any of the vias. The concept behind the solder mask defined thermo pad is twofold. Number one, you're damming in the solder so that it doesn't flow anywhere and so that you don't get any voiding whatsoever. And you have an, a nice evenly balanced paste mask so that the part doesn't teeter-totter and that you put the holes in between the apertures where you don't get any solder paste going down the hole. You have to tent the vias because you're going to put solder mask over them so if you have a 0.25 millimeter hole or a 0.3 millimeter hole, you just need to separate your apertures a little bit further apart in the tools options. That concludes our video on thermal pad solder mass defined apertures. Simplify, standardize, and automate an entire IPC and IEC compliant library. Detailed, accurate, reliable, professional highest quality footprints and 3D step models, clicks away. Many companies worldwide are easily generating their CAD libraries. You should too. Get a fully functional footprint expert evaluation license for any CAD format and demo today. Contact us at pcblibraries.com or call 847-557-2300.